Greetings, Noble Heart viewers. Thank you so much for your consistency in season one, which focused on identity. Yeah, it's been quite a drag. Do you agree with me? Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Yeah, it's been quite a drag. You can tell me about it. Anyways, we're moving on to season two now, which focuses on, want to guess? Marriage! Yay! I mean, who doesn't want to get married in the sanctuary? Who doesn't? Huh? Well, of course, maybe not everyone wants to get married, but hey, we are going to get some answers. All right. Come with me. Follow me. Stick with me. Tune in. Anyways, these are the questions that are going to be answered. What is marriage to you? Which three or more principles are the foundation of your marriage? Any word of encouragement for marriages out there, tune in, like, subscribe, share with others. You never know who might need it out there. Thank you so much once more. Enjoy. Hi, guys. Hi. My name is Michael. My name is Faith. And we are the Stalwart Lovers. Lovers. Yes. <laughs> All right. So what does marriage mean to us? Yes. Uh, marriage to me is two people, the union of two people that are ready to make things work like you come together you are willing to make things work for the rest of your life you know and that's basically what it is to me like it's not yeah hard to... and for me marriage is purpose mm, yes. marriage is believing in one goal one purpose mm -hmm. working yes. as a team teamwork yes. and leveraging on each other's strength mm -hmm. to make the marriage successful yes 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 okay so next question mm -hmm. um three or more foundations of our marriage mm. okay so let's go so so three or more foundations of our marriage yes yeah, so i'll say god is the first foundation because i mean god god literally orchestrated this god created this so um that is like the major foundation that mm. is the core I, I always tell people that this is that god is the core of our relationship what is the core of our marriage you know so yeah. that's basically it so the other foundation the next foundation of our marriage is love yes we love each other we are <laughs> we really do. in love with each other so we are yes. not just partners or roommates or business partners who are team team players we are lovers and, yes. and i think marriage should be a union of lovers you must yes. be in love with your spouse mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah that's right and then the third one is who can guess communication yeah, yeah, yes yeah. communication is like the bedrock apart from god and love obviously mm -hmm. because we communicate a lot and we believe that us talking us relaying ideas mm. you know those are the things that actually help us to know each other and become united mm. because we we get to align on ideas we get to align on visions we get to align on purpose we get to, through words you know words are very powerful so that's basically it. yeah so, that's it just basically three uh, there are so much more we'll just so leave much it at more. that mm -hmm. Okay, so last last question is advice for marriages. So what's your advice mm. for marriages? Well, I'll say number one, keep God at the center of everything. Like mm. God must be your perfect middleman. <laughs> your perfect boss, your perfect leader, you know. This is you, this is you, this is your spouse, this is God at the center. So God is like the middle ground for both of you. So even if you're having issues because of God, you are going to be able to resolve those issues. If you are having challenges that you are praying about, that too becoming one, two we chase 10,000 force, you know, mm. put it together. So God is actually the center and you should put God first. Like God mm. is going to make your life much easier. Very Fantastic. Easy. What I would just add to that is work as a team. All right. Yeah. Work as a team. Mm -hmm. The Amos 3, 3 says, can two work together except they agree. All yes. right. So whether you are the man or you are the wife, make sure that you are working as a team yeah. you're not better than the other person just because you're a particular gender you must leverage each other's strength yes. to make the marriage work mm -hmm. be deliberate about making the marriage work as a team mm. and i think that will just help you know yes yes okay <laughs> so follow us on instagram at yeah. the underscore stalwart underscore lovers so mm -hmm. that's what we are and then my my id is mike.fabi mm -hmm. and she is fate.fabi yeah feel free to follow us on instagram on youtube we are the stalwart lovers yeah you know and that's it mm -hmm. 
all right so keep watching noble hearts <laughs> bye guys